can't get over the water graphics. Got a fish there. Um, just going to see if there's any um, thing to grab. Don't really think there is. Okay, let's just go under and um, grab what we need. Okay, let's see. Now that I've gotten that, I'll just inspect that um, shed a bit in, in a bit more detail. There's nothing there. What about over here? No, it doesn't seem like there's anything. Oh, shit, 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 shit. Shit, 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 shit. Water graphics and just the rain. Um. Hey, be careful crossing that thing. I will. Okay, before we go up there. Okay, before we go up there, I'm just going to check over here. Someone's been camping out here. Be pretty bloody scary camping over there. Oh. It's too small. Great. I forgot to leave that stupid robot on his grave. What should I do with it? Um, what? I want to talk about it. No. Why not? How many times do we need to go over this? Things happen and we move on. It's just. That's enough. <sighs> All right. I'm sorry. Let's get to Tommy's. Sometimes when Joel can be really insensitive, like, yeah, okay, he's lost a um, daughter, but you no, know, he's got this kid Ellie who really, you know, needs an adult to talk to about these matters. I feel sorry for her, he always seems to silence her out and somehow she keeps um, the cool with a lot of this. Oh, I'm so hungry. I know, I am too. Let's get past this place, then we can scrounge up some food. So let's continue on.
Oh, what's that? Oh, sweet. I want to know whether this is a real weapon. Sorry, I'll... Pretty awesome, like, a um, rifle-like handgun with a um, scope. Right, anyway, let's continue. Don't even think about reaching for your weapon. Tell the girl to drop hers now. Ellie, do as the lady says. Hey, please tell me you're lost. Oh, we didn't know the place was occupied. We're just trying to make our way through. Through to where? They're all right. Wait, you know these people? I know him. He's my goddamn brother. Tommy. Holy shit. <laughs> How you doing, baby brother? Goddamn. Yeah. Let me look at you. You get fucking old. Easy. Won't happen to you, too. This is Maria. Be nice to her. She sort of runs things around here. Ma'am, thanks for not blowing my head off. Would have been embarrassing, considering you're my brother-in-law. <sighs> we all gotta get wrangled up at some point. Well. Ellie, right? Yeah. What brings you through here? Uh... That's kind of a long story. Why don't we bring him inside? You hungry? Starving. A lot of bandits in this area. It's been quiet for a few days. What the hell are you doing here? I thought I'd find you in Jackson. Been trying to bring the plant back to life. We had it working before, but one of the turbines went south. We have electricity, Joe. I had. We'll get it running again. No way. You guys have horses. We got a whole lot of them. Hey, Tommy, give me a hand with this. Sorry, I'll be right back. Can I? Yeah, of course. He likes when you set his ears. You ever ride one? I actually have. Hey, buddy. What have you ridden a horse? Uh, Winston, this soldier back in the town. Could be luck. You know, if you want, we can take him riding later. That'd be awesome. There. Hey, thanks, Tommy. No sweat. All right, let's continue the tour. Earl? Yeah? Why are you here? Weren't you supposed to head back this morning? Still waiting on Halva and the rest of the boys who are leaving. Yeah, we'll be fine. Just go home to your family. Just a couple more hours. I'll tough it out. All right, thanks. Take it easy. Six time of them trying to get the turbines back online. We've been here just a week and it feels like forever. Uh, I got something for you. Last year I went back to Texas, back home. Most of our stuff is long gone. Most of it. Here. It's a little faded, but it still looks pretty good. I'm good. You sure? I mean, I said I'm good. Okay. I'll hold on to it for you. Tell me, I... 
I need to talk to you. Private. Yeah. Okay. Let me just check on my guys. Come on. Just gonna take a slight detour. Don't wanna make it bloody smooth on. For protection. The adults take turns guarding the perimeter. We even got an electrified fence when we plant them. You still got to deal with infected, though, right? Who doesn't? But it's the world we live in. Or maybe you don't have to. <laughs> you sound like Marlene. Hey, hey Butterfoot. That's Buckley. Not much of a guard dog. That's a good boy. Well, he's good to have around. Two geniuses are gonna bring this plant back to life. We think we got it this time. <laughs> you don't believe us? I didn't say that. I'll bet you a million bucks it works. Sure. Make it two. Say that. It's it's pretty to awesome. No rush. Alright, wait a second. I'm just going around here. maxed out that. Now what else can we do? To the left. Watch it. How cool is okay, this? Good news. 